So done the hull, done the sides, gel coated. Um, and now we are going to put some 6010 vinyl ester resin with a bit of chop as a tie layer, two ounce. And that's the very first layer that goes on fiberglass wise um, after the gel coat before the main lamb starts. This is a two tone coloured hull. We've got white bottoms black side so that's why you see the black here and the white on the bottom uh, we spray the white first and then after the white gel coat goes off we spray our coloured sides black and then after that goes off we start the tie layer. We just did the tie layer yesterday. The boys have bubble checked the tie layer, uh, making sure that there's no air between our fiberglass and our gel coat, and they've prepped the whole hull. Now we're gonna set up to do the strake. So now we're gonna lay up the strakes only, ready for a main lamb tomorrow. So we do a little bit of a main lamb in the strake, so tomorrow we can bog it and do a full main lamb over the whole hull. So we filled our strakes uh, because when we go to glass, it's easy to glass just straight over them. Also, there won't be uh, air void in the strakes. Um, um, obviously, on the bottom of the boat, your strakes coming off and on a trailer, you want that to be super duper solid. Um, so that'll never chip out or never crack or anything. Um, and just roll them wise and lay up. Uh, it's just easier to glass straight over the flat, then go in your strakes and out your strakes, especially when you're laying up double bias. Um, it's a bit finicky sometimes over the rounds and that, um, so it just makes the layout process a lot better. All right, so the benefits of using this glass is it's a good multi-directional strength because you've got uh, double, 45 double bias there. Infu improved resin flow and bonding. Also has good impact resistance. So the chop side will go down to the tie layer and that'll help with the print through. And then they've got the strength of the double bias on the back. Well, the benefit of using this sort of fiberglass is that it reduces labor and it adds uh, more strength because you're reducing the amount of resin in the boat and adding uh, structural glass instead of resin.